G'day guys, Melbourne Scrapper here. I want to show you a bit of my copper recovery operation. So basically what I do is I accumulate all the TV oaks from all the ones uh, TVs I scrap. Uh, when I can be bothered, bring them here, smack them with the block splitter, as you've seen in my previous video. All I take out is the nuggets in there. The rest goes in, you know, copper bearing motors. If I can be bothered, I'll cut that. Otherwise, you know, copper bearing motors. That will add up and I'll put in the next section how much copper I recover from this lot. Then we've got my degaussing stash. Uh, just keep them in there. Keep them nice and clean in this bag. Don't get overwhelmed by it. And you know, when I can be feel like stripping or watching a movie <laughs> and stripping wire, I'll, I'll do that. And you know, you can get really thick ones and the copper adds up nicely. Guys, that's it. Uh, stay tuned for how much copper I recover in here. Guys, give it a go. G'day guys, so here's the copper I recovered, it's about 5 kilos, at $5.50 a kilo it's $27.50, so it's about 10-11 pounds. A um, couple just quick hints and tips, take your copper in a bag, they won't deduct uh, you any weight for it, if you bring it in a bucket they'll deduct weight, and um, I kind of adjust it so it's 5 kilos flat, otherwise they tend to round. And sometimes it can be in your favour, sometimes it can be to your detriment. You might, you might lose 100 grams here and there. And that's going to add up. So that's just a tip if you want to take the time to do that. Guys, give it a go.